list okay and in this list we have couple of delimiters okay how can i convert this automatic you know all the delimiter to consider and give the data like that okay so let's directly jump into the example so here i have the data okay i have converted this data into the table and give the data so let me remove the filter let onboard this data into the uh, power query i don't have any query right now so this is a manual task you know the manual solution so i can give manual split the query now okay so i just remove this particular one so let me see what we can do it to when you extract the type of delimiter so i selected this data let me do the split column by delimiter let me give any single delimiter okay i i am going to um, edit my formulas okay so i have given this delimiter click okay then type i can see what the formula is being written i written over here it's a dot okay so now in these things if i if we, i have couple of different instead of this particular one with parenthesis code you know this particular two code i can give my different type of delimiter and in power query the powerful function is split text by any delimiter okay so now give enter yeah you can see i can get all my different different delimiter now so this is very excellent my system can understand everything now okay let me load it okay so i can go directly close and load to this is my manual loading so i can come over here. i click over here now okay my data is behaving like that okay this is what i had told manually because you know i went there i inserted the particular list and i have written this particular list as manually okay so now what else i can give with a uh, automation okay so let me remove the let me come to over here there he has given a different different delimiter because this all data having this limiter dot or hyphen or you know the backslash so let me create this as a table okay so let me go to the data and from data go to sheet okay so i can give this name as delimiter it's okay for me and uh, you can see this particular is a list so what i can do directly as it is coming from that particular table let me convert this particular list list so this you can see this is a particular icon can this is called a delimiter list okay so now what will happen okay so let me this particular delimiter is my query okay so let me load this as a connection because i do the data set let me load it as a connection over here okay now the earlier manual problem what i did it from this particular table okay so there where i have written manually i need to replace that manual letter by this delimiter so how can i do it let me duplicate this one i can give this is a dynamic solution one okay so when i say dynamic solution one let me give one so what i'm trying to do over here okay wherever this split happen you know this particular one okay so now this particular delimiter i have created a list so can i give this delimiter list over here if i go to this particular one the list which i manually i have written i can give enter wow it is working so tomorrow if anything will change it will be work automatically okay so let me load this close and load to okay let's click okay fine it's working so let me see if i can uh, different data you can see i have new data over here and this data is delimited by you know the semicolon you know the, there is another the icon i have given so that is a vertical bar i had okay this is my, my old manual data if i did it i can refresh so what will happen this old i have given manually that means when hyphen is here the backslash is there it will refresh which is coming from my manual split now you can see santos underscore 85 is coming one plus kamla is coming on different plus because i have manually given it over here okay so now here also it is splitted but this cannot understand the vertical bar because vertical bar is not let me come to here okay here if i do refresh it will also going to be work the same thing so let me it will bring the same thing over here now. let me bring the table what is okay so these are the table list is over here so now if you see add this here wow refresh this table instead of going and manually typing it let me bring a list which can understand apart from your text and numeric value what are the list are there then make it a uh, unique value like remove all the duplicates and then i will apply the same thing into my so what i'm trying to do now i just want to load the same table okay and i want to create a more dynamic list okay the the, the delimiter data 
okay so when i say dui delimiter basically i want to create so now what i am going to do from here in power query we have a excellent function okay uh, list i can give like this okay so now in power query we have a function called text dot remove okay remove is here okay let me open the bracket so in text dot remove it ask okay um, name i want this particular column i want okay column heading then what are the things i want to remove it i want to remove just want to copy paste there so like a to z it's just small case capital a to capital z i want to remove it i want to remove my uh, zero if i give click okay what is happening it create a list you know it just remove all the there and it will bring all the numeric character over here okay so i want to keep this one okay remove all of the list now so from here it is three times so there are so many times repeated is that okay so if i want to uh, get by one by one text okay let me uh, create another uh, to split by the characters okay how many characters do i want i want by one okay so what will happen if i do by one okay it will go into the column wise now okay so here i cannot able to get all the unique list from there so what i'm trying to do now instead of doing the column I can go to the advanced, I can select the rows over here. So if I do the rows, what will happen? All the list I came into here, okay? Now the last step, I can give and remove duplicates. Okay, I find these are my list. So then I can convert into the list. Okay, so that's ready for now. So let me see what I can do. Now the same query, I want to go to close and load to let me keep it as a dynamic because this else, you know, what are the dynamic, uh, values are there if i go over here i can see okay we start here okay i can understand from this particular query i get it now the dynamic solution one which i have given from there by creating this list which is really the delimiter which is a manual now in this place i can give this dui delimiter so let me create this duplicate this uh, dynamic solution one let me duplicate this query as a dynamic solution to information dynamic okay so now in this case what will happen so here the dynamic delimiter 2 which is I created okay this list i can copy that function and here instead of delimiter i can give dynamic delimiter okay now things are working whatever i expected it's going to work close and load to let me load to the existing worksheet over here you can see i can load it over here I think are working okay so here i have manually inputted here from that list in this table you can understand what are the delimiter is there and it is bringing to here okay let's see the new data okay so now if you have it in black okay there is an has is there as well okay so now if i bring this data to here okay now if i reload my manual data over here refresh now this has cannot be understood from here now if you see from here i don't need to have to give an hash either it will not work out okay so you can see hash is not working over here okay now you can see if this delimiter if i do a refresh my hash is coming now instead of that hash if i do here delimiter refresh wow this is good this is now understanding in your refresh another hash is there okay so that's it all about thank you